What's up, everybody, and welcome back to Baldur's Gate 3. We are here with Ari, Shadowheart, Karlak, and Astorian. We are right outside the Risen Road. We have this cave here that was infested with the gnolls, and we saved these gentlemen, and we stole the chest. Well, we didn't steal the chest. He kind of just gave it to us to turn in. But anyways, there's a few things left in this cave that I think we can explore, which is up here and then over in this general direction. I just want to see if this cave is actually something to explore instead of just these little tiny areas here. Can we go down here? I don't think we can. Let's not. But it looks like we can get up here. In this area. Yeah, we sure the hell can. So there is... Look, there's another candle. There is some stuff here. Kind of looks like trash, but hey, we got something. It's at least worth... Arrow of Darkness? Spread magical darkness on impact? And darkness is... Basically a blind, right? Well, we can give that to Astorian. Bunch of wine, heavy crossbow. Speaking of a story and, what am I to do? and weapons, let me look at this weapon for Shadowheart. I've been meaning to give her this spear for a long time, and I kind of just forgot. Look, it's a one-handed spear. I could have gave this to her so long ago. We got this when we found Withers in his tomb. That's a promise. When a spear misses its target, the wielder's next attack roll against the target's gain true strike. Let me see what... True strike is. The spellcaster has advantage on attack rolls against its creature. Okay. So this is like a... That's good. The spellcaster. She's basically a spellcaster. This is perfect for her. Okay. Well, there you go. Shadowheart, you got something. Which was better than that basic ass... What were you using? A shovel? Where is it? <laughs> Where's her mace? Didn't she just have a mace? Friends, was she using a torch? No, she wasn't using a torch. What the hell? Where was she? What was she using? It's not here. And oh, I thought this was a shovel. She was using that basic ass mace. Well, that's a huge upgrade for Shadowheart. And then I sent a Starian. Wait. Oh, he didn't even have that on. Shit. He didn't even have the necklace on. But I sent a Starian. Is this a staff? Let me send that to Gale. Because he might actually use that. I sent him this. The Shimitar. I don't... Oh, he's not proficient with martial weapons. Okay, okay. What about Shadowheart? Though, to be fair... What if we give it to Ari? Can we dual wield? Can we dual wield this? And this. We can't dual wield. How would we go about dual wielding? Maybe we put that in the main hand and put this in the off hand? Nah, we can't dual wield. Interesting. Okay, well, it's not a big deal. We gotta figure out how we can dual wield. Wait. Offhand melee. We got a shield. A rapier and a shield. I want to test out this flail. Because it's 2 11. It's, okay, so it's 6 to 11. And this one is 5 to 16. It's probably not that great. But hey, what's the arm and trying? We're proficient in it. And a shield, though? What if Shadowheart can... No, we can't do anything. We can't dual wield anything but a, a shield. <laughs> we got this fucking crazy looking... Walking flail. death. Walking death, he says. Let's go. I don't think there's anything else over here. We're probably going to lose a good deal of DPS using this. But I'm curious, nonetheless, to see what it... To see what it does. I mean, we can... Let me look at it. Let me look at T. Mad. What happens to Mad? 
Hostile to everyone in the vicinity. If we're not hitting... Oh, man, that's going to be rough. <laughs> okay, okay, let's go back. <laughs> let's go back. I don't know about using that. I don't want to get beat up by Carlac. We could try. But to be fair, I don't know if I want to use a shield at the moment. I think the, mo the best defense is literally a good offense. The quicker we kill him... The easier it might get. What the hell is all that? Got a bunch of stuff floating. All right, we got a heavy crossbow, a backpack, an open Harrison. What was that? Hmm. Hmm. Interesting. I don't think there's much to go in here. I think it's just a few chests. And is that it? Yeah, it, it literally is just a few places to go to. Wait, hey, Carlac, hey, pick, pick up this bag. <laughs> huh. I don't think you have a bag on you. Hey, ho. That bedroll, too. You might need it. What is this, a note? <laughs> Few recognize Char as a goddess of creation or Saloon as a goddess of destruction. Yet, both are true. Wait. You recognize Char as a goddess of creation or Saloon as a goddess of destruction. Yet, both are true. Really? Wait, what? Both are the primordial ebb and flow of time. They forge a beer to real together and Shante, mother of life, sprung into existence. Shante, maybe? Sure. Light and dark hung in perfect balance, embracing by Shar and lightened by Saloon. Yet their creations were cold and distant, and Shante prayed for warmth. The simplest request divided the sisters, dividing them to conflict, but it was Saloon that forced true flame into a beer to real, sparking the sun. How could Shar not be harmed by such a betrayal? Forced to war against both light and sun and the light of the moon, as the goddesses tore each other asunder, they formed new gods and new conflicts, all for the sake of a little warmth. The lesson is this, to put selfish comforts over the fate of existence is folly. Those who understand the Lady of Loss is always listening. The Lady of Loss. I feel like that's a drow thing. We may have read that in the beginning as a drow, maybe? Lost sworn? Bro? So, the sisters were at conflict for a long time, and it's almost speaking like Saluna was the bad goddess of destruction, and Shar was the goddess of creation. What the hell? Really? Shall we pick it up and put it in our pack? <laughs> we got so much shit. <laughs> okay, sure. Why not? Look, more stuff. Hey, we're stacking up. We're stacking up on potions for once, which is good. Can't reach it. This will be fun. Why does your dialogue bug out when you say that, Tarlac? Do you hear it? It like skips whenever Watch she says back. that. For some reason. This shall be fun, but it like skips. Is this some kind of bug? Wait, why can't we get over here? Easy. Don't go jumping on this trap. Guidance? We'll use Astarian's guidance, why not? 28. This man is rolling. Wait, his happy buff. <laughs> his happy buffs gives him stuff too. Alright, let's pick this lock. A crooked touch. A crooked touch. Look, he's happy. He's got plus one for being happy. <laughs> 21. Such a beast, the Starion. Reasons grasp. Ever vigilant, when the wearer chooses to end their rage, they gain 15 temporary hit points. Oh, wait, really? That is going to Ari. That's freaking barbarian stuff. We don't ever end our rage, but hey, it's fluffy Still and look barbarian -ish. Despite everything. It's better than these damn gloves. Look at these damn gloves. Let's give these a shadow heart. 
Well, we can give him the Carlac. Well, let's give him the Shadow Heart. And then we'll wear Reason's Grasp. Oh, they are furry and just silky, and I just want to. Just it makes you just want to rub your fingers through it. <laughs> Should we wear this? I'm going to put this on a Starion, I think. But for now. I don't know if it's cursed because it came from that creepy ass butler. Let's just put it on Ari and see what happens. It's nice. Look at these frilly, furry gloves that we got. <laughs> Can't afford to stay idle. Hey, Shadowheart, I have these for you. They kind of match for the most part. Yeah, they match you better than me. Wits and blades always. Let's get back on a Starion. Or. Well, I must heart. keep going. Well, that's it over there. Look at us. We found some barbarian stuff. How delicious. Can you get over here, Astorian? Is it possible? Because there might be more. Yeah, there is more. Fucking rotten cheeses. Wait, there's a wooden trunk. Hold on. What are you doing? Climb on? Was that a bear? You keep hearing that? Lockpick. Alright, you're standing on the chest, pal. Let's guidance it up, and then... He just rolls almost 30s every single time. Fire Amber. Silk Gland. I guess we can just give it all to Ari. He's our pack mule. Okay, Stick I don't like think it. there's anywhere else we can go in here. I doubt we can go down there. I have such a headache. You have such a headache. What path lies before me? It's the urge. I'm telling you. I was hoping you'd come to chat. Hey. What do you need? That pike you got looks really cool. Okay, let's do some things. I want to head back to the grove, but before we head back to the grove, I don't... I don't think there's anything else over here. I'm not going to explore any more in this area. We'll come back to these areas at, at a later date. But I want to head back over to... Hey, take it easy. What's his name? Rugen? Have a good one. Anyways, I want to head back over to this area... Because we have this manor over here, and then there's all types of other stuff. This is, look, investigate the ruins, goblin camp stuff, Halzen. There's all types of things over here, and I want to, whenever we come back over here, I want to work my way this way. But for now, let us head over to this house again. I want to try something. Hey, Fucking soldier. Hell. You guys are so big, get out of the way. I want to head back over to the house because there was a hole that I believe we can get into. We didn't even attempt to get into it, but let's try to get into it. And we still can't raise Anders. I think the problem with Anders was that we tried to raise him beforehand. Let's see. Let's go into a disguise. Into something very, very small. Like a gnome. Oh, yeah. Take it and love it. Look at his big ass head. <laughs> I fucking love it. And then we'll head. Wait, can we go over there? There's something down here. It looked like a minor little bridge. I guess not. Okay. We're working on it. Let's go to this this hole. But I feel like this hole is going to get us into the basement anyway. This bird hole. I just don't feel like a gnome can fit in there. Like a rat, maybe. I'm way too big. Yeah, it's, he's too big for that. I'm way too big. We gotta use a familiar. We gotta use one of Gale's familiars, which is fine. It's no biggie. Let's end this. <laughs> well, we should head back to the grove. I want to head back. Well, no, because I want to go back to the. I want to change the party. I was Fucking hoping you'd hell. come to chat. Why? Why? What do you need? Why do I keep clicking on you guys? <laughs> Excuse me. They're all up on me. <laughs> okay. Let's head towards the grove-ish. And I want to change the party. 
because we're going to do... Can we just teleport to the grove? I guess this is the closest we can go. But I want to change the party because I want to get Lazale in. And then... Go to camp. Let's get Lazale in. Who are we taking out? Shadowheart? I think we're going to take out Shadowheart. I'm keeping Karlak. The reason why I want to go to the grove is because of... Huh. So, that's what people mean when they talk about butterflies in their stomach. Did you want something? <laughs> Look at his face. He's a cheeky bastard, man. <laughs> we should journey separately. If you're sure. Get out, but I'll miss Fine. you. I'll be here. <laughs> Have fun, Shadowheart. Enjoy your new pike that I should have gave you 20 years ago. Okay, we're gonna get in Lazale. We'll and get we haven't fucking went around with Lazale and Gale forever. Speak. We need to. Alright, you get in. It is done. Get in here and hang out with us. You still got Ed in your back pocket? Yeah, she still got Ed. <laughs> look, friends, camp companions. We can look at their inventory right here. That's so great. Anyways, Gale, I think I... This is a quarter staff 0 to 7. Yeah, you're gonna need this one, my friend. That one's way better. Can we mark this? So what if we add it to wares? Tell you what. Just send it all to Carlac. She'll love it. Shadowheart, you got any trash? Carlac. Carlax over encumbered. Oh shit. She has his helmet. Well. She's got this anyway, so I guess it don't matter. Jade. Okay. <laughs> Fuck. Hey Lazale. Eager for battle. <laughs> I would take this off again. Yeah. I just hide it all the time. <laughs> no stop me yet. Let's go! Come on, let's get something going. Let's go in here, and then we're going to talk to Zoru. And then... Oh, damn it. I wanted Shadowheart in the party because I want a fucking steal. Because Shadowheart... Damn it. Okay, okay. No problem. Let's go back to camp one more time. We'll get... Shadowheart back in. Sorry, Lazale. It was fun because I want to try some stuff here. Speak. I want to try a few things with stealing from that vendor just to see if we can do it. Check. You as you. Because Shadowheart has two abilities that I want to check out on Astarian. Now that he has all types of other shit going on, he might be able to I steal. I was hoping you'd come to chat. All right. Okay. I'm gonna be a damn thief. No, but hold on. Shadowheart, we Whatever go comes, to... I'm ready. Lesser Restoration, we can't use it. We need a long rest. Always prepared. I was going to use this on that one lady, but okay, we can't use it anyway. Which is fine. Can we go to... Let's see. Here we are. Shadowheart. Spellbook. How do... Enhance ability right here. Let's get rid of matter command. Enhance. I haven't really been using command at all. Fortunately, I want to use it. Shit. She can't use enhance. We're gonna have to long rest for her to use this. See, because I was reading here, creature gains advantage on dexterity checks. I was wondering if we can hit a starian with this. So we can't hit him with this anyway. All we can hit him with is guidance from Shadowheart. What's the point? I mean, there is a point. Okay, well, we're still gonna try. Let's see what we can do. What if we short rest? Will it bring any of that stuff back? A welcome rest. A welcome rest. Probably not. Well, now we're out of short rest. <laughs> 
Let's see if we can bring that damn ability back. See if it comes back. It doesn't. That's fine. No biggie. Okay. Can't give up now. Well, what we can do is try. I want to try it at least on camera once. And if I can get it, then... Well, I want to do the rest off camera. Because I just don't want to do it. And, through. and then you guys wonder, like, well, how the fuck did you steal? How did you get all that? Well, let's try it. I got some ideas. I have some ideas. We'll get a story in... Up there, though. Let me into the grove. We gotta put Ed somewhere. Oh, there's also a, a grave up here that I want to look at. We will. I got ideas. So we'll go to this guy. We'll buff a Starion. To be fair, I think we should keep everyone right... At least over here. This is pretty far away. Get a Starion out the party. I'm ready. Whatever it takes. Shadow Heart. We hit him with Guidance. Let me save though. We hit him with guidance. Keep your distance, dog. We get on a Starion. Tread carefully. And then we sneak behind this gentleman. On tippy toes. Okay, we go into turn base mode. A little shit. And then we pickpocket him. Hide armor. Let's see what he has. It's in turn base mode, so. Hell with it. See, this is... Let's try to get this one. Not even a challenge. <laughs> we got it! Anything green we should probably get. See, because we got to roll an 8 here. I don't know. I want to roll this. These are blue. No. This looks like purple dye, orange dye, blue dye. Do we want dye? I don't know if I want to steal dye. There's some rings. Hedge Wander Armor. I want to try this one, but... We can get four from Sleight of Hand. And three from Dexterity. But we can still roll as long as we roll an eight on this one. A little souvenir. <laughs> we got some armor! Okay, we just got armor and... Chain Shirt plus one. Ring mail, heavy armor. We gotta roll a 12 on that. What is this? Is this, a, is this clothes? Padded armor? It's light armor. We can try to roll a 7 on that. You're coming with me. <laughs> we got light armor! Good job, Astorian! You're a beast! <laughs> okay, so... How are we gonna do this? We don't have the stealth. Oh, shit! We didn't buy the stealth potion. Well, even if that lady has a stealth potion, but how are we going to possibly do this? We exit turn base mode, but he's probably going to know. Can we fast travel? We can't. You cannot fast travel in turn base mode. Okay. That's fine. So we exit turn base mode. And then fast travel, maybe. <laughs> See ya. See me come. <laughs> All right, you wait here, Astarian. You guys. Is he doing anything? You don't even care. What? What happened here? Oh fuck! I'm running. Let's roll. <laughs> Let's get out of here. Damn it. <laughs> We're fucking screwed, man. If we go back in there, they're gonna be pissed. Let's get a starring in the crew. But no, hold on here. Wish to live in I got an idea. Times. Let's go back to camp. <laughs> well, let's go back to camp. Now, like you don't, there's no way he knows now, right? All right, let's give this one to Ari. Is this a two-handed or is this one-handed? Roan is a hand axe, so it's one-handed. Let's give it to Ari. There's a hide armor or medium armor? A star. <laughs> He's not proficient. What is he proficient in? Cloth? Light armor? There you go, Astarian. Well, that's something. This hide armor. 
I don't know if anyone's proficient in it that can wear it besides Shadowheart. Lazale, but... For now, maybe keep it on you, Astarian. Just... Just for now. Do you think that worked out? I mean, we're gonna find out when we go back, but... That armor on you, sir, looks just... You sure the hell are wearing that? Alright, what now? Alright, let's get a new crew in. With haste. I'm gonna leave Astorian behind. I'm gonna leave Shadowheart behind. Well, well my day just improved. Did you want Astorian. something? If you're sure. Fuck. Astorian just stole the fucking world from that guy. I feel like if we can get the enhance ability, we might have a better chance of getting the rest of the stuff. Need something? <laughs> this armor is just crazy on him. <laughs> Darling, I'm hurt. I thought I... It sounds... <laughs> Sorry, my friend, but you gotta stay here for a while. Look! Let's see how that helmet Speak. though. <laughs> I thought I hit the helmet. It is done. <laughs> you like it will be done. I thought I hit it from, from... Hide all the time. There we go. It's hidden now, right? No, wait. <laughs> It's not hidden yet. Okay, okay. Come on, get in here. We gotta do things with Ed. Let's get Gale into the party, possibly. Wonder if the gods are watching me. And see what he's got going on. How can I help? It's been quite a while, Gale. With? Come on. Get in here. All right, let's go back now. What can possibly go wrong? <laughs> Should we just walk past him? We left. And Astorian's not in our party anymore. Oh, he's got the guidance necklace. That's What if we steal his shit and then sell it back to him? Look, he don't even care. Hey friend. Need anything else? I sure do. I'll come and steal the rest of your wares later. Of course. But please, remember. You're not the only one in need. <laughs> I want to sell off all this stuff that we have. Well, this gentleman doesn't have any more gold, but look at all the gold that we have. We almost have 2,000. He still like us? He has no attitude towards Sylvanas us. Sylvanas be with you. Take care, friend. Thanks for buying all my Looking junk. Ahead. Let's go and talk to people. Let's go see what we got to do. We got to head up another merchant somewhere. There's this old lady down here that we can probably talk to. He's going to knock us prone. Damn. Let's not do that. We still have that that locket that we can hopefully steal back for that guy. <clears throat> but I don't know where we could find that locket from. The only other merchant in here is this alchemist. I wonder if she has true stealth potion. I guess it don't matter now because we figured out how to steal. We just turn-based mode, steal everything we can, and then teleport <laughs> and he's like huh a cosmic wind wait what hello petal need anything any lotions or potions i don't think we need any what harm show me your wares i need help i've been affected by a mind flare as you recount your adventure auntie ethel nods along her eyes wide <gasps> you poor pet my heart goes out to you, truly. But I confess, that doesn't explain all your symptoms. Some of the things you told me, what? I've never heard of a parasite doing that. This is serious. Yeah. I've ne'er a potion or lotion here that could do it, but... Yes, I may have something at home. You invite us over for dinner, such as? My time could be running short. I can't afford to spend time paying you a visit at your house. Such I've as. collected some interesting bits and bobs over the years. You'll have to stop by my house just at the edge of the forest. Let me mark it on your map. I'll be heading back soon, so I can meet you there. Wait, now, don't go. do you need anything? I have a few odds and ends for sale. Yeah, buy all this crap that I got. What harm? Show me your wares. Hey, bother. 
You got, she's got 500 or something. You don't have anything good in here, madam. Acorn Truffle. She's got Carillion's Grace, which is... Where's that for Gale? Let me sell all this junk with Carlac. Here, take all this. I want you to have it. How about a bedroll? Look, Clive, I picked up this in camp. This is Carlax. It was right by her bed. It was a camp. It was in camp. And I also picked up this other stuff. I got a stuffed bear. I got some balls. And we should probably... See, I wonder if we can use it. Like, get, maybe give it to Scratch or something? Possibly? Rope? Do we need rope? See, I don't know if we need some of this stuff. We just got random shit everywhere. But... Be careful on the road. I hate if something happened to you. Take care, Peggy. You're such a nice lady. Ain't she? We're exposed now. I really like her. She seems like a really nice, sweet old lady. Okay, we want to do things and stuff. I think the first thing I want to do is... Carlac. I want to check out, but hold on. We just... Something. What do I want to do? Oh, the journal, journal. Losing my mind. You get help from Auntie Ethel. This is a main quest. Find a cure. We met an eccentric old lady in the Emerald Grove. She's confident she can remove our parasites and invited us to her... Tea house? Die oh, I bet she's looking pretty crazy, house. honestly. I mean, she has a lady paralyzed over here. Let's see if we can talk to this gentleman for Carlac, dammit. Thought I sensed an inferno around here. But you aren't from Elturel. What's your story? I spent a good bit of time in the hells. Enlisted against my will by the Archdevil Zariel. Same as you, I suppose, if you're from Elturel. The devils were delighted when your city was swallowed up. I thought they had you for keeps. Glad you got out. I got lucky. It looks like you did too. And... You brought some infernal machinery with you. A little gift from Zariel. Keeps me burning hot. Very hot by the smell of it. Might be burning out a piston ring or leaking oil. Mind if I take a listen? Be my guest. But don't get too close or your eyes will melt shut. <laughs> Phew! You really are burning up. Whoever put that engine together tried to house metallurgized demano valves inside a Ragnax alloy casement. Very risky. I might be able to help. I'd need infernal iron. And a prayer that my hammer will survive the work. That thing isn't meant to operate outside of Ernest. I'm not sure how much longer it'll keep running the way it's going. Will you be able to turn down the temperature a little? Worried I'm gonna go in for a handshake and singe someone's arm off one of these days. I'd worry about surviving the night first. But help one both. If we can cool you off, it'll stabilize your engine and allow you to touch whomever you please. Nice. Where should we look for infernal iron? We'll keep our eyes open for some iron. Personally, I'd like to know what infernal iron is worth. Well, I don't care what it's worth. If it's gonna help her, it's gonna help her. Where should we even look for this infernal iron? I've sensed some during our travels. It has a, a pull to it. Absolutely magnetic, once you know what you're looking for. I can show you where I'd look. Okay. Maybe we shouldn't really do this. Person, I'd like to know what Infernal Iron is worth. Yeah, I w sure, let me know what, it, what it's worth then. Not much to a regular smith, but a fair bit to a canny buyer. Not that that matters. We want to use it. Not sell it. We sure the fuck do. Well, then we'll keep our eyes open for this iron. Meanwhile, I've still got plenty of weapons and armor in stock if you're looking to load up. A starry in my. Wow, friends. He's got all types of shit. Look at this hand crossbow! We gotta steal it. Yeah, we can just buy it. It's fucking cheap. 
We got a shit ton of gold. We don't need to steal everything. Look at this shield. For Karlak or Karlak. Shadow Heart. We got a long sword plus one. All this stuff is pretty fairly cheap. This hand crossbow. We gotta figure out how to dual wield. Because how cool would it be to have two hand crossbows dual wielding that sucker? It seems more fitting on a Starion though, instead of us. But still, nonetheless, I kind of really want this shield. I'm just gonna buy that shield, I want it. <laughs> I want this shield and I'm a big softy and I feel terrible about stealing. I don't feel terrible, let's just say. I just think we should be careful with it. Added armor. Because he's going to be a lot harder to steal from, probably. All this gold. Let's buy this hand crossbow. Fuck it. Chainmail. This would probably look better on Astorian. No, he can't wear it. He's got to wear claw. And this is a long... Well, this this other stuff. We can Hunter's Mark. Oh, that's so good, probably. What the hell does it even do? Hunter's Mark. Mark a creature as your quarry to deal an additional 1 to 6 slashing damage whenever you hit with a weapon. That, we gotta get that for a Starion. Let's just buy this. We'll give that to a Starion, and then we will sell the other bow back. Unless we can use the other bow on Shadowheart. It might be better on Shadowheart, she's more magical than a Starion. That, okay. I sold him all the rest of these books too to try to make up for, you know, I am what we just bought. Let's go ahead and forge from the heart. Head out. So I miss my forge. We're gonna put. Hold on. Let's put on the hand crossbow. That were I mean it's plus five attack, which is good. But let's put on. Well, or. Yeah, the flail, and then the shield, and see how it is on Ari. Though, to be fair, what I'm envisioning is somehow, eventually, I want to dual wield, man. I want to dual wield, and I want to dual wield not just puny little swords and axes, like one-handed sword and axes. I want to dual wield big-ass great swords and great axes, two of them. That would be so freaking cool. Where's that bow at? Let's send that to Astorian. Okay, Not I think we're fronting. good. Let it's me head to... Hell... Where the fuck is Zoru at? He's not... It was over here, wasn't it? Alright, Zoru's not One there time. anymore. Hold on, let me head into... The Grove anyway. Because... Well, I want to check on Alfira's spot, and maybe, maybe we can put Ed over there. Wait, what's this? Can we put him? Wait. Right. <laughs> I was trying to look up on top of this stuff. Okay, never mind. Let's look where we can. Is there anything here? Does she may leave something? Oh, the poor girl. She's not here anymore, friends, obviously. But I was hoping there was something. Well, I guess we can take her bowl. Assume nothing. Hey, Lazale. Just drop Ed right here. Well, we're in your inventory. Hey, Ed. I have a lot on my mind. You just flopped um, out. Well, in it. <laughs> Can we jump up on these? I was thinking about putting them up really, really high on one of these things. But I don't think we I don't think we can get up there. <laughs> Wait. Is that a chest over there? Is that a chest? <laughs> I think that's a chest up there. Yeah, I was thinking about putting Ed on this right here, this area here, but I don't even want to walk into that. Because well. They'll probably fight us. There you go, Ed. Beautiful things happened over here. Beautiful musics. All types of stuff. 
Was that a chest over there? How are we going to get that chest? At least it looked like a chest. Maybe we can jump? Is it possible? Hey, friends! Look, the bear is still sleeping. Yeah, there's a fucking chest here. Shiny chest. Medium toughness. How are we going to get up there? Doesn't Lazale have... Psionics jump? Can you jump really high up here, Lazale? She sure the fuck can. Watch her. Oof. <laughs> Lazale is taking the shiny key from Aerostar using magic pockets. 69 gold. Wait, is this is this from the bird? The shiny key from the bird that we stole? I'm gonna get down, Lazale. Death is interrupted. Let's go and knock her prone. <laughs> Good riddance, Lazale. Sorry. What the hell? All right, let's go back to camp. Cause I want to get in. Astorian, and I want to take Carla. Hey, soldier. It sounds like all we needed to fix your engine is some infernal iron. I mean, yeah, it sounds like it. Easy peasy. We just gotta find it now. Let's hope Diamond is as good as he seems. Once my engine's handled, I can focus on more important matters: tadpoles, cults, frosty pints. Frosty pints. I'm right there with you. Maybe we should go get some, huh? Should we leave Sounds her behind? Boring. Sorry, I know. Oh, fine. I'll be here eating dirt or what? Let's keep her behind since we were just talking to her, and I want to put a star in because I want to check out that bow. Need something? Lead Get in here. All right, we got this bow. We're a star in now. Oh, that bow's gonna be so good, and we give this one to Shadowheart. And then this armor. I don't know who we can put that on, really. Everyone else wears light oh, armor. I have the magic touch. You wear heavy armor? And you wear it? Or mediums? We can put it on the veil. Can't give up now. But her armor's so good. Careful, I bite. <laughs> sure the fuck do. Let's put this little zail. Lazale, well, you don't match whatsoever. What? 13 armor class, and this is 15 armor class. This advantage on stealth checks. Maybe we should just keep her in this armor here. Honestly. She's got this shiny key she stole from us magically. Shouldn't have wished to live in more interesting Okay, terms. let's get out. Damn it, I'm about to put Karlak back in. Son of a bitch. Never wanted the easy path. Let's just go tall to Zaru. We'll put Karlak in when we get out and about. Friends, we got a fucking magical chest in here. I was thinking about putting Ed up on something, but... <laughs> that poor guy. <laughs> I wanted to give him a better area. You know? I mean, I guess we could have did that with... Alfira as well. I mean, we could have technically put Ed in the chest. The, the camp chest and just traveled her with him in the chest. Where is Zaru at? Oh, you're right here. What the hell are you doing all the way over here, Zaru? Why'd you change your area? By Mordai's eyes, another one. My friend's blood not enough. Come to rip me open too. In Kresh Kalir, a formal greeting begins with a bow. Is this monster with you? I don't know who she is. Nope. <laughs> yes, I suggest you do what she says. You heard the woman bow. We're going to make him bow. I'm not going to tell him to bow, but I'm just going to say just do as the woman says. She seems pretty serious. Look at this fucking bone that we have. <laughs> Starion loved it. <laughs> sure. Lower. Oh, you want him to go lower? She's serious, you better get on your knees fast. Wait for the tiefling to obey. Should we tell him to get on his knees? That's enough, Lazelle. I'll take it from here. She sounds pretty serious. I would just do what she says. <laughs> oh, man, that's rough. 
You saw another gif. Where? On the road, to Baldur's Gate, N near the mountain pass. S saw us, for we saw it. Jammed its blade through Yul's belly, straight to the other side. No twisting. Kin must have been in a hurry. The map. Show me. She's so serious. Up. You can keep your innards. Oh, you're not going to eviscerate him. I was hoping for a show. <laughs> Call your blood. I'll indulge you soon enough. <laughs> okay. I kind of just wanted... Okay, I feel a bit God, bad. That... God, say you later, Zoru. Where you going, man? He's just hauling ass. He's, I'm out of here. I wanted to see what would have happened, I guess, if we just let a companion just take control and just see. But Lazelle... <laughs> Let me look at the journal. Find Gith Yankee Crash. We learned of a Gith Yankee patrol to the northwest. They might be able to lead us to the Crash. Yeah. Hellion's heart. Damon inspected Karlak's engine. He said he'll need infernal iron in order to craft a repair. The Yankee warrior. We spoke to Zoro. He told us. He saw Gith Yankee on the road to Baldur's Gate near the North Mountain Pass in the Northwest. We should travel there with Lazale. Okay. Where's that on the map, though? Speaking of which, did Carlax stuff get on, put on the map here? Elian's heart. There's right here. There is something right here for that for Carlac. Get Anti Elthos help, which is right down in the swamps by Kaga. Hell. Is there any more infernal engine stuff? We're gonna do this. This is right here. We should do. We should make our way. Wait, what is this? Kill Kaga. We just go in there and whoop her ass. There's the sacred idol. I think what we do is we go down to Hellion's heart next. Investigate Kaga and make our way down to this stuff. Yeah, that's gonna be our whole path next. But let's talk to Lazale. The locals prove compliant. A useful trait. Yeah, but we have to get crazy with it, though. Your dab hand at interrogations. We might need that skill again. Well, you are pretty good at interrogations. You had the guy scared shitless, and he literally told us immediately. A snap of a finger, basically. Do you plan to be that rough? I say it's, it's just her nature, though. It's kind of how Get the Yankee are. Maybe we haven't met other Gith Yankee yet, actually. We've only met Lazale. So we don't really know what comes next. I'd say you have a dab hand at an interrogation, sure. We may need you to use that again in the future. A shell so thin requires little to crack it. The tea sling was clear. If there are Gith Yankee west of here, that must be our objective. Purification cannot wait. I mean I I definitely understand. What do you mean purification? Hey, did you say teeth, Ling? <laughs> I want to say this. I want to know what purification is. What do you mean purification? The crash holds the Zathisk. It will cleanse us of the parasite. By covenant, I can say no more. Hey, uh, did you say teeth, Ling? I am unfamiliar with the, well, I shall not say culture, custom, perhaps. You will educate me on matters of this fey run. <laughs> no, no, it's fey rune. Are we going to correct her? <laughs> because I feel like every time I say something, it needs to be corrected, too, because I say something that's definitely wrong. Fey rune? <laughs> fey rune. That's kind of how I would say it. I, I think I would speak more like Lazale than anything. No, no, it's favor. <laughs> Sorry. Take care. Have a good day. Anything else? Speak. I always want to speak. Is it me, or have you been looking at me differently? I have 
have a confession. I was too hasty to judge you. I thought you witless, gutless, unimpressively bland. <laughs> Can I assume a compliments is incoming? <laughs> and I thought you cruel, stubborn, and judgmental. And what about now? So I wanna... <laughs> cool. <laughs> what about now? I assume a compliment's incoming? Sure. I don't pay compliments. I only say what is true. You've proven me wrong at every turn. You are efficient, dominant, courageous. I swear, you would tear the horns off one dragon for plunging into another. You've gained my respect, and more still, my yearning. When I come near, your odor alone is enough to make my neck sweat and my hair stand on end. <laughs> this is getting heated. The attraction is mutual as hell. You know how to set my heart racing. Oh, we gonna commit to Lazale? Okay, let's just look at his cheeky bastard again. He's so cheeky all the fucking time. <laughs> if you respect me so much, then why are you such a prickly grouch? Hold on. Are you coming? I thought <laughs> I thought it said Grinch at first. <laughs> I was gonna say, wait, no, er, looking like the Grinch, not really, maybe a little bit. <laughs> Lazale is pretty. I really think she's attractive in her own way. <laughs> Hold on, are you coming on to me? The attract I I kinda wanna take it a little bit. I wanna see. I wanna flirt. I wanna Yeah. Okay, so we got Shadow Heart that we're gonna take a little bit. Now I'm thinking taking Lazelle as well. And then when we get to other people, we'll see if we wanna do it. But I like it, Lazelle. The attraction is mutual. You know how to set my heart racing. Good. I want to taste you. Perhaps tonight. Perhaps later, but I want it all the same. Do you? Yes. I want to share my body with you. Sure thing. I've been waiting. <laughs> sure thing. I've been wanting a hot Githyanki girlfriend. <laughs> I'm flattered by the answers now. Yes! Come on! Share my body! Look at her face. She's so seductive right now. I love it. <laughs> yeah, share my body. Yes. Perhaps one night soon, I will come to your bunk and take what is mine. Until that night comes, I shall keep enjoying your scent. Swing and swivel and this wait. is so spicy. <laughs> oh, brace! We can brace for range. Hold on here, pal. Oh, it's because of this. That makes sense. That just turned a whole 180, basically. And... No time to rest. Well, we don't there again. Speak. What are you doing, man? I think Lazelle wants to get it on, friends. You've set up earned your respect, so... Why are you so rude all the time? I'm ending our fling, if one can call it that. <laughs> okay. I don't feel like she's being rude. I just feel like it's her nature. She, she's so dominant, and you could just tell by the way she was flirting. She's basically like, I want you to lay on the bed, or not even the bed. Just go lay on that fucking rock over there, and I'll be over there to take care of whatever I gotta take care of in a in a moment. <laughs> what is that? Not kind of. I don't know. Well, it's kind of hot, I guess. Sure. <laughs> it's kind of hot in her own way. So why are you so rude all the time? If you yeah. must know, Vlekith requires everything of her children. I can't count how many bruises I've inflicted. Can't measure how much blood I've drawn in the Undying Queen's name. I know only blood red and death black. My mind is silver and my body steel. I am what I must be. Say what I must be. To survive every beast I face and every wound I bear. I wonder what it's like. Wait for me at camp now. I wonder what it's going to be like if we can get onto Lazale's like soft side. 
And just because she's so hard, she's so hardened, so driven of a character, it makes me wonder how good, how good her story arc is actually going to be. Because I feel like if we take her a little far, well, romance-wise at least, we'd be able to see a soft side. Not just the sexual soft side, you know what I mean here. The soft side, as in just, just her open up a little bit, you know? Open up her mind and just soul with Ari. And, like, that... <laughs> Lazale had me all types of blush in there because, like, she was so, like, forward and straight. Like, just blunt force with it. I Like, I want to taste you type of shit. <laughs> That's what she said. Okay. Fuck it. Let's go. Hold on. There's a corpse over here, and I want to do stuff with it. I want to wake it up. <laughs> it was right here when I was exploring around the Cammon's belongings. Freshly turned soil shifts beneath your feet as you approach the grave. Do we really look around cautiously then begin to dig? We gonna grave dig this sucker? The shovel in turned soil feels oddly familiar. Within your sick heart, you know, in grave digging, you have quite the body count. They should be grateful to be exhumed by one with such skill. Push deeper in your head. Where are these thoughts coming from? Ignore the flashes of bodies which have come before. Let's push deeper and see where these thoughts are coming from. You can from. remember only the mangled orgy of dead flesh you've dug up. But not a single name or face. Is this lady okay? Is it? Friends, we just dug this man out of his fucking grave, Ganon. Well, at least we learned more about the urge. Kind of. We didn't get far into it. Let's see if we can just raise him then. See what he's got going on. Oh, I feel dirty for doing that, man. Can we put the him back in the grave? regards you lifelessly. Who are you? Where do you keep your valuables? What happened to you? Yeah, where do you keep your value? Couldn't take much in bedroll. What happened to you? Killed arrow. Can't breathe. What were you doing when you were killed? Who killed you? You can ask who he is, but what were you doing when you were killed? Guarding gate have to open. Who killed you? There were goblins. Aradin followed. We can ask more. Who are you? Cannon. The spell's power wanes. You can ask no more questions. Damn. It really wasn't much, man. We just dig this guy out to ask some basic ass questions. He said his belongings. Someone there? I correct. I think so. We're gonna take this guy's belongings. This lady's like right over there. She's coming back. Oh, we were about to take it too. Let blood? me talk to you though, ma'am. No, never because, mind. Because well, I just dug up a corpse right here. No more trouble yet. Yeah, that wasn't me. He's just over there chilling. We can't put him back in his grave. What the fuck, man? <laughs> the crap that we get into. Literally. We can steal from this guy's belongings. Never I mean, he said... Yeah, I kind of want to see what it is now. Cannon's belongings. Oh, shit. Corpse. We done stole it all. Okay, let's leave. This way. Come on. What Everyone leave. Do? I'll ask. Can't slow down. Okay, we should head to camp, obviously. And I want to get Karlag into the party. Should we try to see what this infernal coin is over here? Oh, 
Brilliant's heart. Wait, where's that at? Oh! That's right across this bridge over here. Wait, no. At that... Hell. There's the get the... Oh, man. I'm glad we didn't explore around over here. We would have ran right into this. This is... Yeah, we should go over here. Obviously. That's what we're going to do next episode. Whoa. What's going on? We're hiding in the grass. Let's go back to camp. Should we long rest at camp? We need the long rest anyway, all things considered. Let's long rest. Yeah, let's long rest. We need to go back to camp and do... Get our spell slots back up for Shadowheart anyway. I mean, we had a pretty nasty fight last time. Hey, Karlak! Copper for your thoughts. I want to get Karlak's approval up, dammit, because I want to see more of her story. We got Lizelle's up there. We got Shadowheart's up there. Karlak's lacking. I feel like Karlak and... Gale are very much lacking, story-wise. You know, I've been catching myself smiling more lately. Really? I think that's your fault. <laughs> you and I, there's something special. I think we should talk about it. No, let's not. Let's not talk about it right now. <laughs> I'm still like... Need something? Fluster with the Zale stuff. It wasn't unexpected, but it was so blunt that it was just so cool. <laughs> Speak. Anything else, Azale? I'm ending our fling. So it's definitely a fling right now. It's a fling with Shadowheart as well. But right, we'll, we'll see what happens. Take it easy, Will. I think we keep this party, but the thing is... I want Karlak in, but I also want Lazale and Gale in as well. We're gonna have to not go around with Astarian, I think. I think Astarian is the odd man out at the moment. Oh, but we gotta bring Shadowheart in, don't we? Do we need her heals? That's the main reason why we went back. We can't... As much as I want to bring Shadowheart, we can't always bring Shadowheart. We have to bring other people as well. But this seat, remember many episodes ago I said, you know, the main character is like maybe a rogue or a cleric would be feeling really good. So we don't always have to bring the same ones. And I don't usually bring the same characters in games all the time. I like to spread it out. So I like, to, I like to get to know everybody. But let us go away from... Need something? A story in. Oh, darling, I'm... For now. Uh, it sounds... I also think I want to make a story in... I want to put him back as an assassin. I feel like the assassin was just hitting way harder. So we should probably do that now. I can do it. It don't matter. I'll just probably do it off camera. Just to get him back into assassin. I'm going to keep him with the same... The same as what we had last time. Of course. Let's take guidance off of him. And give it to... Let's just give it to Lazale for now. There you go. Enjoy that Still guidance, alive. madam. So that's progress. And then let's Wonder get back in Karlak. So me. I think Karlak and Gale needs to be in the party for a little while. Hey, we soldier. Need... We need to get some approval with them. Hell yes. Get in here. Stop eating that dirt. No one stopped. Yeah, me we're gonna yet. we're gonna pal around with this crew for a while. Then we probably don't really need Lazale. Actually, thinking about it, we could probably go to Shadowheart. We really could. Or because this is a very melee heavy group. Okay. Mine never quiet. Our approval with Lazale just went up. Speak. Let's take her out now. <laughs> Are you sure that's the best course of action? Confirmed. Until then, I remain at the ready. Oh, so it was different. Damn. Well, I guess I didn't need the fat. Didn't need the fast forward to that stuff. Okay, let's get Lazale. Send this to... You know what? We can't always... Speak. Let's put her back in. <laughs> Get in it here! 
Get back in. We'll just keep her in for now. We'll try shit. Despite Anyways, no one. It doesn't look like anyone has anything at camp. Did Gail have anything? <laughs> I'm indecisive. How do you even pick between the companions, help? man? Like it's impossible to pick between any of them. It doesn't look like there's anything going on. Scratch. Hope you're keeping well, friend. Wait, Scratch. So I have this ball here. Can I just give it to him? Is it possible to give him this ball? Or did I sell it? Oh no, it's right here. Bro. Yeah, I can't give it a scratch. Let me throw it though. Look! We can hit him with it. You get the ball! <laughs> that is so fucking cool, man. Hey, scratch. Come on, let's play again. Look, he just runs out. I'm gonna throw it really far. I'm gonna throw it at Astarian. Let's throw it right next to him. Let's not hit him. Go get it. Oh, this is so awesome. <laughs> I love Larian for doing this. All right, one more time, Scratch. One more time. One more time for the road, my friend, because I gotta sleep. Let's throw it right next to Carlac. But we hit her. <laughs> I don't wanna hit her. Go get it! He loves it, man. Okay, we're forever keeping that ball on us. I'm glad I looked in the inventory for that. Or just anything mind. and seen that. Um, Alright, let's go to sleep. Well, it's been a it. rough day. It's been an interesting day. I think we should auto. Should we auto do it? Yeah. Let's auto do it. Let's do a full rest. I've come to sate you and be sated. I lead, you follow. We ready? Let's just go with it. Let's see what happens. Yeah, I'm ready. So you think. Let's see if you're right. <laughs> oh, I'm about to sleep. We really gonna get it on? Gith train relentlessly. We know our bodies inside and out. Let me show you. Oh, Close shit. Close your eyes and submit. We're gonna fucking get it on. <laughs> Wait, if we're gonna get it on here... <laughs> Are we gonna be locked in? <laughs> because, like... <laughs> okay. Close your eyes. You are hers. Barbarian, I do not submit. And I don't want submission from you. Show me your rage. Oh, hell yes. <laughs> Friends. I'm feeling a little overdressed for this situation at the moment. <laughs> well. Show me your rage. I think she liked it. <laughs> I am ready. <laughs> okay, so... <laughs> mm. well. You awake in pain. Your back, your hands, even your tongue ache. It's time to rise. Dawn is upon us. <laughs> Last night was wonderful. I really enjoyed myself. Why such a hurry? Relax. Come rest. Let's rage out again in bed. Why not? Yes, of course. We'll leave at first light. Hold on. I need a moment to recover. <laughs> Hell. Last night was wonderful. I really enjoyed myself. How about round two? Of course you did. I'm as extraordinary in bed as I am on the battlefield. 
<laughs> Grimace at her arrogance. Are you satisfied as well? I've had better. What if she just said that? <laughs> Shake off the ache and rise. I don't want to look weak, okay? We raged out. She raged out. We're both good to go, I think. Do you think we can make love again soon? <laughs> what comes next for us? Make love. <laughs> There's so many interesting ones to say. Are you satisfied as well? Did we just ask her if she's satisfied? Do you think we can make love again? What comes next for us? Yeah. Are you satisfied? My hunger is sated for now, yes. I might <laughs> even lay you again, should my whim so take me. Up now. Your moment's over. Every breath, every blink proves exhausting. A long day awaits you. <laughs> this dangle was hanging. <laughs> you see it? Big old fucking tree trunk. <laughs> Well, he is uh, a pretty big guy. <laughs> Look, Scratch has something! Wait, what's this? Oh. Hey, Scratch, you didn't witness that, did you? Dog pants through a ball held firmly in his mouth. Wait. Damn it. I didn't put this stuff on. Let him keep the ball. Animal handing. Encourage him to drop the ball. Slide a hand. Distract him while one hand. Distract him with one hand and slip the ball from his jaws with the other. Strength. Wrestle. Should we wrestle the ball from him? Let's, oh, we're definitely not going to be able to do this. <laughs> we did it! Hey, Scratch, give me that ball! He relinquishes the ball. It is well chewed and slick with drool. Pet him. Let me pet him. Scratch, I wish I had talked to animals when I'm sorry, my friend. We probably missed some good stuff. Damn it. Why did I forget? Scratch's ball! Son of a bitch. Friends, uh, we, uh, we made love <laughs> with Lazale. Hope you're keeping well, friend. Hey, Scratch, you want to play ball? Damn it. Well, that was still really cool, not hearing what Scratch said. Hey, Scratch, I got your ball. I guess we can get rid of the other ball now, bro. Go get it. Again, you're awesome, Scratch. Hey, Lizelle. Curious. I drained you dry, yet your body seems no more worse for wear. Perhaps I might find use for it again. <laughs> I drained you dry. <laughs> Any chance of sharing our bunks again anytime soon? I'll consider it if I am in need of relief. Until then, I'll enjoy watching you squirm from the anticipation of it. Okay. <laughs> it's so rugged. I really like it. <laughs> I think. Well, my day just improved. Hey, shut up. Did you want something? We didn't have sex, I swear. Nothing happened. We were just expecting... <laughs> we were just... Teaching each other how to rage. I was teaching her how to rage, technically. But she's not really a barb, you know? Take care. Actually, I want to ask about us, actually. Just to see what happened. Well, my day just improved. Did you want something? So I'm thinking that Lazelle isn't really... We're, we're not locked into anyone right now. That was just a casual lay. Just kind of getting some stress off our shoulders and just doing, doing it. You and I. We share something special, so let's talk about Very it. Very serious of you, but go ahead. Nothing. How are we, how, yeah, how are you faring? A minute you never have a relationship like this? I can't do it's it. It's strange. 
I've been dwelling on what I told you before about wanting to become a Dark Justicia. But perhaps I should be content with my lot. I'm already blessed to have you at my side, after all. So, okay, take care. It's like polar opposites. Like the, a romance with Shadowheart would be so different than possibly a romance with Lazale. Or just anyone, if you think about it. Because Shadowheart's so... She's just different. She's so, like, sweet. Innocent, almost. Lazale just straight up took what's hers. <laughs> I'd imagine that Carlac would probably straight up take what's hers. Astorian would probably be romantic, sweet, a bit more forceful than Shadowheart. I think Will would be more or less like Shadowheart, I'd imagine. And Gale probably would be like Shadowheart, too. Like, kind of reserved, innocent type feel. <laughs> Hell, man. That was interesting. Let me just go around and talk to everyone else just to make sure. But next episode... I hear you did the deed. How was your little romp? More than a romp. It was fantastic. Could have been, could have been better. More than a romp. It was fantastic. You could have joined in if you wanted. You filthy devil. <gasps> I'm shocked. I thought the two of you would just flop about like dying fish and then call it a night. But no. Shows me. Uh, but you're not here to gossip. What can I do for you? <laughs> Take care. <laughs> Starion said something about it. That's so cool. <laughs> Speak. Hey, people know about our romp, supposedly. <laughs> What's up, Will? You know about that romp? Well met. <laughs> you don't even care. You don't give a shit. Gail, you got anything going on? What's on your mind? Astarian. <laughs> I really love him because he don't give a fuck. He just straight up... <laughs> he just says what's on his mind. It's like all the companions here. They like they don't care. They just say what's on their mind. What's on your it. mind? What's on your mind? Okay, well, nobody else has anything. Next episode, we're going to head over to where this infernal coin is. Or her. And we're going to check out what it is is or, or the coin infernal coin i keep saying the infernal coin because we got to give her these coins soul coin they're soul coins oh we didn't do it in battle last time we should do it in battle whenever we get in battle again but we're going to go to well can't show it but we're going to go to where that iron is for her and the area because well it's kind of close to that goblin camp really i wonder if we should wait and then go down to like Auntie Ethel and Kaga, investigate Kaga. But anyways, my friends, I'm out of here. Have a good one. Stay safe. See you next time. Take care.